And the wait has finally ended. Apple has now unveiled its next iPhone lineup, launching four new models as well as other products at its California streaming event. Last year's model, just like that, the new iPhone 13 will come in four different variants. The iPhone 13, iPhone 13 mini, iPhone 13 Pro and the iPhone 13 Pro Max. The prices start from 70,000 rupees and go all the way up to 180,000 rupees. The screen size of all four variants is the same and the overall design is very similar to their respective predecessors. In India, pre-orders will start on 17th of September and they're scheduled to be in stores by 24th of September. Possibly the most notable change in the latest high-end iPhone 13 will be the option of storage, which is up to one TV. Apple is also promising better cameras on iPhone 13, including an improved ultra-wide lens, a cinematic-like video feature and technology for better nighttime pictures. Now, the company promises 1.5 hours, in fact, at least double to what it was previously of better battery life on the iPhone 13 mini and the iPhone 13 Pro compared to their predecessors, while the iPhone 13 and iPhone 13 Pro Max boast of at least two and a, two and a half hours of better battery life. drives us to create the best iPhone possible, to create an experience unlike any other with legendary ease of use. Let's go, 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 go. This is iPhone 13. Apple CEO Tim Cook doubled down on his company's main moneymaker Tuesday, introducing four versions of the new iPhone 13. There are incremental improvements like sleeker and more colorful outsides, faster processing chips inside, brighter screens, better graphic displays, and sharper cameras in these newer models, all aimed at getting those who still hold an iPhone 10 or older version to finally let go and upgrade to 5G, the next generation of wireless technology. Apple VP for product marketing for the iPhone, Kyan Drantz. Millions and millions of iPhone users are already experiencing 5G every day for super fast downloads and uploads, lower latency and new experiences on the go. The world is moving quickly to 5G. We're collaborating with more carrier partners for the best call quality, performance, coverage, and battery life. Apple isn't the only one eager to get customers to trade up. Mobile carriers are throwing in discounts that could ultimately make the cost of the upgrade free. There's an iPhone 13 mini, which starts at $699, and the iPhone 13 beginning at $799, with some wireless carriers willing to throw in up to $700 for qualifying trade-ins. The higher-end pro versions are priced at $999 and $1,099. The trade-in offers are up to $1,000. All four models will be available beginning September 24th. The iPhones aren't the only things getting a nip and a tuck. iPads are getting new cameras. Plus, the Mini is getting 5G connectivity. And the new Apple Watch will have a bigger display screen and a full on-screen keyboard for typing. Adjustments to make it work better with updates to the Apple Fitness subscription service, which will now have group workouts. The new Apple Watch 7 will ship later this fall with a price tag starting at $399.